Today was the weirdest day. Started off with a great coffee with my friend Linda, and then I tried to pitch the tent and mess that up, not the tent, but the video. And um, then my brain shut down and I took a nap and it got better, but I woke up and saw smoke on the horizon. So Robert and I took off to go find out about that. And then I got swarmed with all of these flying ants and um, I don't even know how to present this video to you. I just know that I want to share it with you. So th this is just a hodgepodge of my day. My friend Linda and I got up early this morning and had coffee. It was such a beautiful morning. And now she's gone to town, as has my friend Robert. So it's just Nani and I in camp. And I'm staying behind because I have got to try, try, try to get my van projects done. So I'm going to set up a tent, my tent for the first time. And I am going to put all of my project stuff in there so that I have room to work in the van. I want to get my screens done, curtains made, and get my reflectics covered so that it's pretty and, um, and cover them also with black on one side so, um, uh, because the paint's flecking off the black paint. So I've got three major projects to do. I've got four days to do it in and I need to get busy. Right now I have my summer sleeping bag hanging for shade because the east sun is coming in. That's one reason why I need to get curtains made and I don't have my reflectix up because I want to be able to see the fantastic views here uh, but I still need to be able to swing a curtain sometimes. So uh, part, part of the three projects is getting curtains made so I don't have to use my sleeping bag. So here's where I store my tent, my yoga mat, and that's where it has resided. I used to tent camp before I got my van. Uh, the dogs and I were tent camping in state parks till I figured out what I was going to do and. I was so blessed to have so many people support me in this lifestyle. And this is a new tent. I've never set it up before. So we'll see how this goes since I've been having trouble processing and I'm in camp by myself today. But I want to really give it a try and see if I can do it myself.
Well, for whatever reason, my camera wasn't on when I set this up, but basically it's you just pull these four poles apart until this metal part clicks in. But I bought this tent so I could stand up in it, and it doesn't look like I can do that. So I'm going to go get my friend Robert, who's back from town, to see if I've done something wrong. I don't know if you can tell this difference or not, but that's blue sky. And that's not so much. We've got something moving in. And Robert and I are going to go check it out, make sure it's not a fire. So Robert and I are driving to go see what we can see and um, figure out what this is. It looks like smoke and it's getting thicker. We're hoping it's blowing in an opposite direction. Well, not an opposite direction. We're hoping it's blowing east. If it's blowing south, we'll have to vacate. Hang tight. I just got swarmed and covered in something. I've got to get out of here. Hold on. See you down the road. <laughs>